Hello everyone, watch this review here with a really quick look at the Riddler from Funko's DC Mystery Minis line. Picked this guy up in a little blind box the other day. You know, pretty excited about him, thought I'd just show him off real quickly. This is a very cute design. You know, sort of stylist with the uh, giant sized head and everything. But I love the sort of detail we have here with his little suit and all the little question marks. And if you look at that face, it's so adorable. Now the little um, Riddler cane here is removable. Of course, it'd look weird posed without it. I think they probably did this just because it might break in box because it's a little bit more brittle. And he does feature some head movement here, so you can sort of have him beckoning towards you, or you know he can be posed with his staff, which is really cool. You know, just very sort of neat quality here. Though I'm not so fond of this weird seam just running along his chin. It's kind of funky. Um, as for the line itself, um, you can pick these up at, I know I've seen these at like Hot Topic and stuff, generally they range for between 6 bucks and 8 bucks. I just got this off Amazon, I think I paid like 7 shipped. You'll notice that the uh, size of the box have the sort of more cartoony versions of the characters. Very neat. The line is uh, mostly Batman figures, though. We've got like six different versions of Batman between the blue and gray sort of detective version and the, like the all black, such as you'd see in the films. There are also three different Batgirls, two Catwomen, three comic Jokers, three movie Jokers, then two Penguins and a Riddler. Riddler, oddly enough, is just like 118 rarity, which seems kind of standard for this. The most common seems to be the 1 in 12 for like one of the Batmans over there. Um, honestly, I was hoping to get one of the villains, so I think I did make out pretty okay. Especially because once I saw this guy out pack, I think he's pretty awesome. Though, I would have also been really happy with either a Penguin or a Comic Joker. I'm not sure how many more I'll pick up with these, but you know, it's sort of a nice sort of one-off item. Just to toss up on the shelf. And, um, you know, the price tag, we're a, little, a bit much for a figure this size, 2.5 inches, by the way. Uh, it's sort of the range that you find, like, a lot of blind box goods for, between, like, 5 and 10 bucks, so it's not, like, outrageous from that standpoint. At any rate, this has been a look at the Riddler, who I think is absolutely adorable. Until next time, folks.